Simon. We're from Missoula, Montana. This song is about the freedom to ride your spacecraft. It's such a rush to come to a, a small city and have, you know, 150 people show up and just go ape shit over you. We're gonna travel to the land that I forgot. Sexy astronaut. It's awesome. I mean, it's so awesome. It's really liberating when, when people dig it and they respond, especially when they dance or they sing or they, you can tell they're just enjoying it. it. We feed off that and then they feed off of it. So it keeps going and then it just, like, you hit this you know, pinnacle. It builds your self-esteem that you can, uh, you know, entertain people and accomplish things, and you're faced with challenges, whether they're physical or um, emotional, and to, you know, meet those challenges, it is um, good for your integrity, good for my integrity, and it's something that's really important to me, and I love doing it. Well, we haven't really had a good tour, a good long tour for. Boy, it's probably been a couple of years. This is the uh, Sonic Infection tour for our new album, Science Faction. It's also the reunion of the Mustache tour. We're going to Spokane, Richland, Portland, Eureka, San Francisco, Sacramento, Seattle, Bellingham, Moscow, I think. Touring is is probably the most fun I've, I've ever had. I mean, as far as just like, you drink until you don't care about the noise and the uncomfortable conditions. But to all, I mean, it's so much fun just to meet people, to see live music from all over the world. There's a whole energy on tour, and you just we just laugh so hard at the most meaningless notions. In the road, that's all we do is laugh. We eat and we laugh. And I feel like, yeah, someone's laughing, that means that, that they're like the ultimate form of happy. They're, they, they're so happy that it's coming out of them physically. You know? <laughs> we tour in an ambulance. It says volume in on the plates. It says volume in backwards on the hood. We spray paint a volume in all over it. You see a, a beat up ambulance rolling around town and you know it's volume in's rig. You pull up to a gig and people are drawn to it, you know? Like you run the lights a little bit, you run the sirens, and people are just like, well, what's that? You know, and they run over there, and then you jump out in a skeleton costume, and they're just like, the hell are you guys? Music is, to me, a return to the pulse of your being, especially playing the drums, like boom, crack, boom, crack. And it's like, it's almost religious in a way where it, it negates any other concern. It is spiritual in a sense to just be able to close your eyes and just to let your body play the song. You can definitely reach some outer body experiences on stage, you know, whether it's the whiskey talking or the music or the people in the crowd and the energy on stage or all the elements. It's really important, and although it's easy to say that, you know, playing rock music and drinking beer and sleeping on people's floors and getting and being really juvenile with the guys is an indulgence, which it, it is. It also, I feel like it's it's important to your flow as a creative individual. I struggle with like, what is a successful band? Is it a band that's on a large label who's getting large cash advances in a fancy touring van, touring three months out of the year and selling 10,000 records? A part of that is super enticing to me. And then I think about what do we have? And you know, we've, we have a great relationship with everyone and we have fun, we look forward to touring. And I mean, that's huge to me. Thank you.
The fact that we're not this resounding success, I don't really let it bug me, you know? As long as I know it's good and people say that it's still good and they like it, fuck it, you know? In our minds, we've already made it because we get to be together and play music and write music and play shows and take tours and that the, the reward is in the process. We all realize that. It's not like we're trying to make something happen and if it doesn't happen, then it's failed. It, you know, we've already succeeded because it's happening. Music is freedom. If you can do what you truly love and be happy and not hurt anybody doing it and hopefully make other people happy, you're a success. Thank you.